another <clears throat> Gondorian Let's Play episode in version 5. So, the Witch King has come of Angmar, and we need to deal with him. So, we're about to shovel everything we have against him and try and eliminate him. And we're going to sally for him. So, we're going to move him. We're going to move Boromir. And we're also going to move Denethor. Which will give me five generals against... Their one general. Now this is mostly chaff. He is the problem. Killing these Temple Knights. Because if these Temple Knights go uh, berserk along our lines, it'll be a very bad day for us. I'll just put it that way. I moved my spy over here to see what's going on here. Looks like they have a force. We know they have some forces over here that they're moving in. So we'll see exactly what's going on there. Over here, this has been a point of contention. So... I'm going to move this army away until I can actually fight it and then I'll move it back because it crashes. Every single time they attack and I fight this, try and fight the battle to delay them as much as possible with casualties, uh, we die. Uh, or not die. Uh, it, just, it just crashes. So I'm not entirely sure what's going on. I really don't. It's very confusing, so we'll see what we can get ourselves into there. So, I'm going to move here and gather up what troops we can. So, I'm going to move them away to, like, right here. And then try and fight them. Um, we're going to do that, actually, right now. So, like I said, I did have a recording where I recorded all of this and have actually fought all this. I've done it twice and it, it, and it just crashes. So uh, I'm just going to move him out of the way and then it'll allow me to get my troops up and then we'll fight it and then we'll move on. Even though that would kind of hurt, but I'm not going to auto-resolve something to, and take the loss when I can inflict way more casualties upon them. So we'll move them over there for now. But... Oh, and I'm also going to do this. I'm going to go to game options, and I'm going to... No campaign battle time limit. The main reason why we're doing this is because this is going to take a while to beat this. It took me 30 minutes to beat it last time. To beat it to where... I didn't take a bunch of casualties. So that's what's going to happen. So, let's sally forth Felimir. And teach them a bloody lesson. That they soon will not forget. Do you have the knife fighter trait by chance? No. No. You do not. Alright, that's fine. Alright, let's get cracking. Don't let them any further. So. I did take your pieces of advice into consideration. I'm going to start doing a better job of not queuing up things and building them. It's going to take more time in the campaign, and that's typically why I do it, as I just queue it up. And I don't have to think about it, but um, anyways. Alright. You hold out there. You guys do the same. And there... There and there. Hopefully we can have a repeat of our success. So yeah. That's why I did no battle time limit. Because it's going to take them a while just to get online. Start marching. Hopefully you don't get too tired out on the march. This, they, do, they have a negative uh, coefficient when it comes to this. So the bodyguards will be fine. It's these militia units are going to tire out. Because they're going across. They're going uphill. Well, it should be fine now. Because there's a little bit of a hill right here. So they suffer a negative penalty going up the hill. Alright, halt. I have a lot of a special abilities here. I have four characters, so that gives you 50% to um, combat effectiveness. That's 50%. That's 150, I believe. Yep. And this is 150% to your 
army fatigue permanent and or plus so it gives you more fatigue back and 50% to enemies combat effectiveness so you pop that and they're doing like 50% more damage upon them so anyways yep move it's gonna take a while because it's gonna take a while to get our army into position Should have had him just keep marching. You're going to be greatly appreciative in this battle. I'm going to appreciate you a lot, Denethor, because you're going to be able to deal with the cavalry. You, not so much. But you will be able to. I think our stake unit is actually the veterans, but I could be wrong. It might be... The Guardians of Oskiliath, possibly. I wish you still started with the Wardens of the White Tree, because uh, that's just that's such a great unit to have as a starting wonder. Maybe why shouldn't you be like Fountain Guard? That makes more sense, since the Fountain Guard is actually in Minas Tilith. To have a unit of him as the Fountain Guard, that would make more sense. But anyways, no one talks to me about those situations. Yeah. Move into position. You. Start moving. Starting to maneuver some troops. walk there's no need to run we got all the time in the world to fight this battle if it takes 40 minutes to fight this battle we'll fight this battle on our terms not theirs you will be a reserve force the spears will actually lead will actually lead And then we will interdict that with three of them. There we go. Alright, where are you? You three? Down. Perfect. We've arrived and we are not tired. Oh, they are. Alright, you two start marching. You three move up. To there. Perfect. You move up as well. You about right there. You there. You there. You there. Yep, that's how we'll do it. These guys are going to protect them if they decide to launch a cavalry charge against us. Which they might. Alright. If you notice, we kind of have like a one, two, kind of lined up here. Yeah, these guys are tired. Hopefully they can recover some of it. Before battle is joined. You're going to hang back here. You're going to move up in between. Let me know when we're at the extent of our range. These guys have 220, he has 190. So 190 is still a really good range. And he has a 7 missile too. Wait a minute, no, he may not be a 7, he may be a 6 missile, but still. Oh, perfect. Shoot the orc host. They're going to provide the biggest problem for us. Ok, 
good. Sorry about that. Alright. Wait, what are you doing? Shoot them! You already could shoot them. I'd stop. Fly. Now you're getting cut to pieces. Alright, looks like they're starting to make their move. So pull back. Pull back. Those orc scouts do not do a lot of damage. <laughs> Stop it, fly. Go charge them. Anybody in range? Shoot the orc maulers. Charge. That'll be an excellent charge on that unit. Should be a really good exchange too. Oh yeah. That was an excellent exchange. Pull back. There they come. How are we doing? Pull back behind the fountain guard. Spears over here. You right here and you as a reserve. Let's go. Oh, come on. Drop pikes. Form up. You come over here. Start zipping in shots. There we go. Where is the Maulers? The Orc Band, I'm not worried about. They're just chaff. It's the Raiders that in Orc Coast. Where are the Raiders? Where's the, you know... Where are the Maulers at? There they are. You're going to charge an elite spear unit head on. Yeah, that'll work out to your favor. Spears get them. Get them. You three move up. You cease fire and go after them. That's not going to end well for you, by the way. Yeah. Pop that. You hold off. Pop yours. Pop yours. And pop yours. Identify targets. That orc coast is getting butchered. Okay. Where's the extreme right? You engage them. What's left of the temple knights? Not many. Six. Oh, that's still a slight problem, but not that big of a problem. All right. Go along that left flank if possible. Yep, stay there. Keep shooting. Yep, yep, stay there. It's time to slaughter some orcs. Unfortunately, my general has decided over here to go suicidal. Charge all the way back there in their back lines. Keep firing. For the moment, the fortune of battle goes our way. Let's pray it remains Into them. Such. All of these units over here. Except for you. 
Pull back just a little so you can have a little bit better range. Stop firing. You now into that flank over there. Where is the... There he is. There's only four of them. So, oh no, three. It's the Witch King and a few others. You. In. Doing well over here. Alright. Um... You come over here. And you just smashed into all of them. Pull away. Don't need you to die because of my stupidity. Come on, charge. Get away. You should be able to do it. We've killed 29%. Keep up the fire. Pop that. Who's that? I don't know. Right. Rally up. You go left. Okay. You get out of that mode and attack. Yeah, this is just taking forever. Maulers about to be chewed through. Once they get chewed through, it's just these chaff units. Hmm. Walk ban. Kind of ensnared them in a funnel. We just got to close the jaws, as it were. Um, they're pulling back the raiders for some unknown reason. Really? You're going to charge into an armor-piercing infantry unit. That'll go over well. Said no one. Not don't attack them. Attack the Temple Knights. You guys stay there. Only half the enemy force remains. And we've lost 11%. That's not too bad. Pull up. Orc band. How are we doing? Good. Relatively well. Run away. Come over here. Now you have a straight shot into them. This should be a good charge. Oh, it is. It's going to be righteous. Get them. Yeah, that blob is rapidly shrinking. All right, you guys come over here. We're going to unleash you. Pull away. Into them. You're doing well. Fetterman, have I used yours? Yep. Go over there. Pop that. Can I separate you off? Possibly? Yeah, those raiders are just going to get cut to pieces. Yeah, they're not doing well. Yeah, y'all ain't trading well at all. Get around their flank. You three, stop that. 
Fuck now. Let's try to get him to push. Okay. Um, you go pick a fight with them. And you do the same. Yeah, I'm not worried about that. Yep, you attack them, you'll be able to drive them from the field. Pop that. He's all that remains of his bodyguard unit. They could not breach the Numenorean shield wall, not with this rabble. Y'all are closing in on them. We need to deal with him. Where is he? There he is. He kind of blends in with the surroundings, to be honest. Turn back. Boom. They ain't gonna survive long. Nope, you're not. Ooh, it's taking us a long time to chew through all this. Oh, now they're breaking. Now they're breaking. That's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. You out of arrows? Yep. <laughs> they're just sitting there with their swords like, let me at them. No, you'll be all right. Perfect. We ended their resistance. Quite easily, actually. Be awed by the victory we have won here to That's a lot, but I couldn't surround them or morale break them. But I think that army, if I would have fought them in the field, they would have morale broke. Uh, long before it got to that point, but because they had the Witch King, as soon as the Witch King went away, they just routed off the field. But as long as he's around them, he <clears throat> the, the, the enemies don't don't break very easily when he's on the field. They they don't break at all, actually. So. Ready your weapons. Right. Hmm. Worried about what's going on up here. So the blood of Numenor. Protect the blood of You get in there. You go the eastern Osciliath. Ready your weapons. I'm gonna pull everyone that I have out of that fort. Awaiting your command. And you go there. And we'll see what we can do next turn. Hopefully I can shuffle you back over there, Denethor. Alright. Over here we're going to have some issues, but we'll see what we can do. Protect the blood of Numenor. Let us sit up camp. And turn. So far so good. I hate when the game crashes and you have to alter what could have, would have happened uh, by moving troops. Alright, so you're still going in to fight. How's that possible? So am I still going to have to auto-resolve this? I'm very confused. Okay. Let me do something. Because I'm afraid it's going to crash. So, let's re... Oh, thank you. Don't really care. My computer and EA are hooked up, so that's why that popped up. Oof. My elbow just popped. Uh 
Okay. Yeah, so I'm gonna stick you. let's move you further then. Because I'm afraid that it's going to crash. Because it's crashed the other two times. And I don't know what's causing it. So, when in doubt, do this. Typically works. Um, doesn't always, but it typically works. So, we'll move you over there and we'll see what happens. Hopefully... We don't actually fight this battle, but anyways, or if we fight it, we fight it on our terms. And yes, it does benefit me, but like I said, I've tried it twice and each one crashed. And you haven't seen that, and I've also wasted about an hour. Well, actually, I've wasted about two hours of time doing that. So we're going to do this. All right, they moved on. Good. They just kept it under siege. That's great. I'll move them back. I guess if they're in a certain range, they can still do it. Okay, so you're going to talk to me. I have a feeling I know what you're going to do. Because <clears throat> I've seen this twice over. No, actually you didn't. Really? And where is my Diplo? Your orders. Move here. Yes. What is it you wish to discuss? We'll take all of this. No, we cannot agree. Another proposition. We're happy to listen. Well, they took that. I accept this well that seemed fruitful as you wish perfect tomorrow's journey planned out a ship I don't need a ship well actually yes, no right. actually I do kind of need a ship that would actually be good yes, so you go there what's going on here oh, still alright alrighty so they have not come that's uh, good and this situation down here needs to be with some resolved um, shortly but I don't know if I have the strength to resolve it all right um Denethor go back there because that'll solve that problem don't need that don't even oh wait that's been a smoke oh, actually I do need that and I do need the um, that as well the mines will help because that'll give me an instant 400 boost okay um Ready your weapon. Bodimir, go back there. Protect the blood of Numenor. Interesting. Um Ships ready. Go further to Pelagria. We'll have you hold there. Um Okay, okay. They still will have to take that. <clears throat> Um awaiting your command. Fountain Guard, go back and get retrained. If that's possible. Yeah, get retrained. And then I need all of these units. Every single one of them. Uh what are we building? We're building a governor's quarters. Three turns. Okay, so that'll give me more recruitment and free upkeep. Alright. Captain of Gondor. Five turns. Onward. Orders. There we are. Alright, so that's enough of a force to do something. They're still besieging it. Um, Protect the blood of Numenor. Alright, so his, he was Zag off, right? Yeah, he was. Okay, so we'll move him back. Well. Yeah, we'll move him back. Wait. Shit, I don't know what the cursor stat is. Let's see if this will work. Hopefully Mordor doesn't also have this. Sometimes when you do this, uh, you move the wrong character. Okay. So he's right there. If he does attack me, which I don't think he will, now that there's all of these guys here, um, I don't think he'll feel comfortable in attacking me. But he could. I don't think so. If he sally out, it might actually fix the problem, but we'll see. <coughs> these two guys. <clears throat> you need to go west. As you wish. We'll make I was thinking about north, here. but no, no, not north. All right. Um, we do need those two clansmen. They will prove vital 
in the struggles to come. And yes, you move up to Minas Tirith. You will get a unit of rangers and you'll retrain them and possibly retrain all of them. Okay. Um, archers, what can we get here? Those two units, so we definitely do need to do that. We're up to 14%, yeah, so we need that militia garrison quickly. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to achieve that soon. All right, let's hit turn. You need to go talk to the Anduin. Oh, hello. Show yourselves. That's a very large force that you got there. Good news is I may have enough troops to do something about it now. Meaning I have troops in the area to do something about it since I dealt with uh, the Witch King. Which the Witch King or think flourishes. That's, that's not something that I would want to see on that. Unbar, I'm not going to be able to blockade that port, uh, no matter Awaiting how hard I try. Okay, so... Marshmen, assail the enemies of Gondor. Mm, this might work. We'll see what we can do there. That's actually really good. Uh, down here, I do have an extra unit, though. Move north, please. Looks like they're going to siege that out. Uh, move to there. Finally got that port in, so that will help out a ton, and I can trade with myself. Um, I need to get a port going here, and, well, no, I need a port. What will that do? Gives me about the, m about the most, but it'll give me more. Be gone. They need Come to be dealt with. Me. Your will, my lord. As you wish. Camp here. Looks like they haven't decided to do anything stupid up there. That's actually for our betterment. Orders. Okay, this situation. You three, if I put you on the bridge, but I could get you all the way over here. So let's do that. By your command. Um, Protect the blood of Numenor. What do they have? I'm Make curious. Slay them. Oh, like hi. That's going to be a problem. Your will, my lord. Good, March that'll bring war. them into the fight. Perfect. All right. And okay, I'm gonna have to empty. Protect the blood of Numenor. Really, y'all, y'all can't make it. Captain of you can. You can. Just Protect not you for some odd reason. Captain of Gondor. We're going to need everybody we can get our hands on to fight that battle. Do I need to bring him? Mm, possibly. Who's left? Oh yeah, the Fountain Guard. And I'm recruiting them. Perfect. Um, those Kleinsmen are going to be helpful. Uh, believe it or not. How many turns? Two. So that'll be an extra 400 to my treasury. Uh... Okay, so we have that battle, which I'm hoping doesn't crash. Um, because I've not tried attacking out. They've always attacked me, so, and I've never gotten to this point yet. So we'll see about that. Um, in this battle. Okay. How much time are we working with? Okay. So, because that battle took so long. Let's see if we can fight this. But before we do that, I'm going to save this as... Battle 1, in case I have to come back and fight this, because it crashes. Let's well, pray to the Almighty. For the White City. Okay, it's, it's not... Has it crashed yet? Okay, well, it loaded. That still doesn't preclude it from trashing, or pfft, trashing, crashing, but... Uh, we'll see. All right, what's y'all's range? 180. So you have more than these guys, and you have more than the orc, orc archers. All right. 
All right, I want a pikeman's center. And off of that, I want... Well, no, 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 no. Actually. I'm going to put you out as thin as I can get you. I'm going to put you behind. And I'm going to put a unit of spears. Another unit of spears. Infantry. Where's my other infantry unit? Infantry. And infantry to back up the center. Who's all here? And archers in the rear. Perfect. Let's see what they do. Mm, they're shifting. All right, move up just a wee bit. You have a better missile than they do. Actually, no, you might have the same missile, actually. They can outrange you? I believe that's some sorcery, but okay. All right, hold that. They're right there, so you move up. You move up. Who are you? There we go. Move up. Move up. There we go. Except for you. Start hammering them. Come on, shoot back. You're not going to win that skirmisher battle. Fire at the long spears. I think they're realizing that a frontal assault might be futile. I'm kind of just messing around them a little bit. Oh, I forgot to take the battle time limit off. Whoops. Move through, move through, move through. Yeah, that was not a great plan there. On y'all's part. Halt. Start shooting. Oh, now you charge into the cavalry. That makes very little sense. Uh, outflank them. Take them head on. Flank around. Actually, take them head on like this. So. That vanguard is going to be a problem. To should be able to deal with them. Chewing up the cavalry pretty easily. That's going to be a pretty even fight, but with the cavalry or with the archers, should shouldn't be. All right, you guys, turn that direction. You two. Charge against them. Actually, you charge against them. You charge against that. You're starting to overcome that. It's going to take a while, though. Move up. 
are we doing? Not fantastic. By any stretch of the imagination. Pop that again. We are winning there, though. Oh, I have two of these. I forgot. Both of these guys have the leadership quality. Perfect. Keep popping those. How are we doing over here? Well, we will win, but it'll be a bloody engagement. This, it's uh, the same. My hope is, is that we will route these guys. Well, not route them, but we are beating them up pretty good, so that's good. You should only have a four. You, well, you might have a five missile. I thought you just had a four. Yeah. We're winning here. This is where we may not... Oh, they are getting their butts handed to them. Just as heavily armored as you, bud. Still in our favor. They've killed a lot of us. Only half the enemy force remains. Perfect. Looks like they're about to launch a walk assault that they thought better of, and now they're charging again. So, what was the purpose in that? Do a faint retreat, walks. Now granted, you are killing some of us, but you also yourself are getting really chewed up. If we can get a couple wins against these guys, they will break just as easily as um, the, um, the Mordor Orcs do. You just gotta get a couple of wins against them. I gotta take that off. Battle time. How's it going for you? There's their general right there. You guys. Charge. Yeah, that's going to cause a lot of damage to me. We have, but they've lost more than that. I'm surprised it hasn't popped. They're fighting so many enemies, I'm surprised they even have the strength to do what they're doing. The enemy general abandons his men. We've captured the enemy's general. That doesn't matter. Teach the cowardly dog to turn tail and run. The good news is Hopefully we have secure secured our western border for a few turns, at least ten. And there's no real threat to the enemy it. Army be awed by the victory we have won here to they inflicted a lot of casualties upon us. A lot. A lot more than what I would have wanted. Hmm. Never shall they 
Uh, hopefully. Because we just got mauled. Now we do got some reinforcements coming. So move up to there. Let us sit up camp here. Drop a tower. Go take that fort. Let us we'll get some free, up, free upkeep and just see what we can do here. Yeah, we are heavily mauled. My lord. March Not sure we can capitalize at all. Like We're going to need to stabilize this frontier by sending more troops up there. Because if something comes through there, we can't defend that. Maintain all my order. troops are down here. It'd take me three turns to redeploy. So actually, Your will, my lord. start we'll redeploying that here. direction. I have a feeling you're going to be needed over there sooner rather than later. My lord. Ah, this battle. Protect the blood of Numenor. I think we'll save this for next episode. So, until next time, hope you have a good rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one as we fight this battle. And I need to go ahead and take that stupid thing off before I forget. Anyways, so until next time, hope you have a good rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one as we battle Raz, Radzag for control of Kal Andros. So until next time, hope you have a good rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. Ciao for now.